we always practice putting the saliva into the eyes yes. and it has become a culture culture of india hidden culture in years past people have forgotten about it why they put the saliva in the eyes no questions were asked but saliva is the only medicine which is created in the body hence maybe the saliva has got medicine values <laughs> it creates power in the eyes no infection in the eyes but for some it works for some it doesn't work for some it works because they appear for some it doesn't work because there might be a lot of poison nevertheless better late than never if you practice that is very good <laughs> and nowadays for cataract operations and glaucoma never ever a cracked bell never sounds well goes to sing when you once you crack it then you can always see darkness and darkness is less of health when you have less of health less of health is because you keep ordering you go to the hotel and you order so you sit in the chair and you order when you get up from the chair and go pick up things and you do your things you are healthy the moment you order you see darkness and darkness drags you to the hospital to gurus to temples to churches to masjid there also you see only dark holes you can see the idol sitting in a dark hole you never see the light inside the church or the temple or the masjid but when you are healthy you go to those places you can always find <laughs> there is another stage of truth opening for your new health and that is very close to god 28 story from the gateless gate from the book zen flesh zen bones written by paul drips blow out the candle tokusan was studying zen under ryutan one night he came to ryutan and asked many questions the teacher said the night is getting old why don't you retire the night is getting old the darkness is getting old because the more the questions you ask more you are getting old to because first of all there is no questions when you are born with truths when you are born with wealth where there is questions you have to only polish it up you are forgotten to polish to polish you don't have to go to the goldsmith to polish it is a way of life when the parents practice then parents practice the samskriti then it is polished automatically then there is no questions neither there is answers because questions and answers only are going to create a division between you and the family you and the people it is a way of life it is just beautiful it is an experience it is an organic orgasmic experience one night he came to rio and asked many questions the teacher said the night is getting old why don't you retire retire means why don't you go and relax why don't you allow the mind the chattering mind to relax retire means to meditate so in that emptiness you know neither truth prevails neither god is there but the truth and god is there so tokus on board and open the screen to go out observing it is very dark outside root and offward a lighted candle to find its way just as tokus and received it root and blew it out at that moment the mind of tokusan is opened the moment tokusan was about to go out he saw it is pitch dark outside so he said it is pitch dark this teacher gave him a lighted candle the moment the student took the lighted candle he blew it out the teacher blew it out at that time the student's mind opened oh my god there's no light you don't need a light from another person to go into the darkness because in the darkness you can see so much beautiful light darkness is not light is not even the absence of light is darkness not even the absence of truth is lies it is just a beauty dark and the light is wide open he got his satori he got his health back he got his family back he got connected to the joint family in the family tree at that moment the mind of tokusan is open